Welcome, fellow car enthusiasts, to Auto Hell. Today, we're diving into a scorching debate that's been heating up the world of luxury sedans. We've seen the arrival of some impressive contenders this year, prowling the streets of our posh estates and upscale business districts. I'm talking about none other than the 2024 BMW 5 Series and the Mercedes-Benz E-Class, both flaunting their sleek updates. But what sets them apart, especially here in the United States, is their electrification strategy. You see, while the Mercedes-Benz E-Class is currently sticking with mild hybrid electrification, BMW is coming in hot with a plug-in hybrid PHEV option right out of the gate. Sure, Mercedes might catch up eventually, but today we're diving into why the BMW 5 Series PHEV is worth the anticipation. 3. Blending electrification with a straight six. Now, I know not everyone is ready to bid farewell to the good old internal combustion engine, IC. If you're one of those folks who still crave the visceral growl of an engine but also want a taste of electrification in your daily commute, then the BMW 5 Series PHEV could be your perfect match. We're talking about two versions here, the 530E and the 550E. What's confirmed for the United States is the 550E, and it comes with X-Drive all-wheel drive, AWD, to boot. BMW's naming scheme may seem a bit confusing these days, but trust me, the 550E doesn't pack a massive V-weight under the hood. Instead, it boasts a mighty 3.0-liter turbocharged straight-six engine, specifically the B58 engine that's graced numerous BMWs. This power plant delivers smooth, punchy performance and, when tuned right, a sweet engine note. But hold on, there's an even hotter version on the horizon, the rumored M560E X-Drive, which should inherit the raucous character of the V8-powered M550i X-Drive. Now, the magic happens when you blend that straight-six engine with an electric motor integrated into the ZF 8-speed automatic. The result? A staggering 483 horsepower and 516 pound-feet of torque. That translates to a blistering 062 MPH, 100 km h, sprint in just 4.3 seconds, and an electronically limited top speed of 155 meter h. 2. More electric range, faster charging. Let's talk electric. The 550X drive packs a 19.4 kW lithium-ion battery pack, which gives it a pure electric range estimated to be around 49.56 miles, though we're waiting on that EPA rating. But wait, that's double the electric range of the previous generation 530B, which could only manage 21 miles. That's more power and more guilt-free, zero emissions driving. Isn't that a win-win? And if you're worried about downtime for charging, fret not. BMW has ramped up the charging speeds for the 550, hitting up to 7.4 kilodollars AC. That's double the previous generation 530 maximum charging speed, meaning you can fully juice up in just three hours and 15 minutes. Charging from a standard household outlet takes a bit longer, around 12 hours. Keep in mind though, this isn't a full EV, so no fast DC charging here. One, it's all about the sporty thrills. Now, if you're like me and crave a sporty driving experience, the Bimmer is the way to go. While we're still waiting for the reviews on the new 5 Series, history tells us the BMW knows how to deliver an engaging drive. Not that the E-Class is a slouch, it's a fantastic car in its own right, but it leans more towards comfort and luxury, not necessarily driver engagement. But what about the ultimate in sportiness? That's where the upcoming M Performance version of the 5 Series, PHAV, the M560E X-Drive, comes into play. While it might not match the 4.4-liter twin-turbo V8 of the outgoing m 55 i X-Drive's 523 horsepower and 553 pound-feet of torque, it's no slouch with 565 horsepower and 590 pound-feet. However, Due to the added weight of the PHEV system, it clocks a 062 MPH time of 4.0 seconds, slightly behind the M550i. And don't think BMW is done there. The future holds an electrified M5 in store. While the engine details aren't confirmed yet, it's likely to follow the footsteps of the XM with a twin-turbo V8 and electric motor combo. 
pushing the power to at least 644 horses and 590 pound-feet of torque. But who knows? BMW might decide to go all out and adopt the XM Label Red's even more potent PHEV drivetrain, delivering a jaw-dropping 738 horses and 738 pound-feet. Now let's throw in a juicy comparison against the equally fresh Mercedes-Benz E-Class. But here's the twist. As of now, the E-Class won't be offering a PHEV option initially. To keep things spicy, we'll also consider the non-PHEV versions of the 5 Series. So to sum it all up, the 550X drive is confirmed for the United States, and it's shaping up to be a compelling choice. But how does it stack up against the equally new Mercedes-Benz E-Class? Well, as of now, the E-Class doesn't offer a PHEV option in the States. Let's take a quick look at the lineup. In the 2024 BMW 5 Series corner, we have the 530i with a 2.0-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, the 540i with a 3.0-liter turbocharged straight-six, and of course the 550e xDrive, our PHEV champion. While in the 2024 Mercedes-Benz E-Class corner, it's the E350 with a 2.0-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, the E450 with a 3.0-liter turbocharged straight-six. The 550e xDrive is here to give the E-Class a run for its money. Stay tuned for our upcoming video review, where we'll delve even deeper into this electrifying battle. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you never miss a beat here at Auto Hill. Got questions or comments? Fire away and I'll make sure to address them in our next video. Until then, stay revved up and I'll catch you on the next ride.